people have been avoiding emergency rooms and hospitals because they are afraid they might get COVID-19. As a result, people who need emergency care are not getting it in time, if at all. Dr. Diana Henderson is the Chief Medical Officer for Methodist Hospital Metropolitan. She joins me today to give us some peace of mind on the ER situation. Doctor, welcome. What a good subject to talk about right now. Uh, First question, when should patients seek help and why is it so important not to wait? Some medical conditions are really uh, important to have treated within one hour of beginning symptoms. Um, Those such as heart attacks and strokes, it's really important to get to the emergency room right away. And what we're seeing is that people are scared. They're staying at home. And so conditions that could have been treated with medications um, then have really bad outcomes and people become very ill and even pass away. Other conditions such as life-threatening infections, again, people staying at home, scared to come to the hospital, uh, they could have been treated. And so we want people to know that even with COVID, you still need to come into the hospital. Yes, that's a very good point. And you're disinfecting. I know that's the concern for many, but you're just disinfecting your hospitals. What's the procedure and how safe are they right now? Well, with healthcare at all times, we want to provide a germ-free environment for our patients. And with COVID, we're just stepping that up. And so our housekeeping staff are rounding through the hospital. They're um, checking all the uh, high touch surfaces that we call them uh, in waiting areas and um, the uh, admitting, uh, looking at the nurses stations, computer monitors, and cleaning those several times a day to make sure that uh, those areas are germ free. And our our housekeeping staff use uh, chemicals that kill 99% of organisms. And so all those germs uh, are being killed with uh, the chemicals that they're using. And our staff spend over an hour sterilizing rooms, uh, uh, killing the germs on all of the surfaces. And then those rooms are are closed for an hour afterwards just to give those germs time to to not be present. And um, our, our housekeeping staff, and uh, as well as many staff come into the hospital in the street clothes and then change into scrubs so that we can limit exposure of germs coming into the hospital. And so we're really focused on making sure that the hospital is a safe place and that our patients know that they can come here and, and get good care. And we know COVID cases are on the rise right now. So why is it so important to wear a mask and when should you wear one? Um, Wearing a mask is so important for decreasing the spread of COVID. And really, uh, people should wear a mask anytime they're outside of their home. And what you're doing is you're you're protecting yourself and you're protecting others. The other things that we really want to have people do is uh, hand hygiene, washing your hands frequently, and then social distancing, staying at least least six feet away from other people. And so our, our message is really stay at home, wear a mask, but when you need care, come to the hospital and know that it's a safe place. Well said. Thank you so much. So don't wait until it's too late. For more information, visit Methodist's website, sahealth.com, or give them a call, 210-575-0355. Dr. Henderson, thank you so much and stay safe out there.